Surprisingly, it's looking like the Englishman who will be out first. Gary Schofield. What a great player. 26 test tries to his name. He will lead out the Englishman in place of Hanley. Just wait for the reception for the visitors to our shores. Mal Meninga, what a moment for him. 13 times he's led his country down the tunnel. And he will be made to feel like a king himself as he makes his way out with his teammates to try and get the job done in this first test. Jackson keen to get on with it as they get held up in the tunnel. But now it's welcome home. They did it 22 years ago, Australia kick off in the defence of the Ashes. The ball comes back. Betts to bring it away, just 11 metres out from his own line. Through the forwards. Skerritt. Wide they go to Gregory, to Schofield. Plenty of ball movement. Mark the fire. Langer's there. He beats him. Eddinghausen. No, yes. Oh, what a start. Martin Afire thought he had the try. That was magic. He got nice and deep, tried to make the advantage line. Did well to get it 15 metres out. Bradley Clyde, good short ball. Jackson cops a high one. Jackson was off a short ball from Clyde. Gregory just left a board right around the throat. Well, the thing about Andy Gregory there is he's that small. He's honestly taken three steps up a ladder to jump and get him. Well, I said he might be lucky. He's not so lucky. He grabs 10 minutes. And he is the playmaker. He's gone and out of here. Plenty of Great Britain defence there. Walters finding a hole and then finds Jackson. Jackson looks for support. He had Langer there, but not quick enough. Little Alfie on the fifth tackle. Langer looking to kick. Her fire's back there. Has got it covered well, her fire. A fire on Wishart. Wishart around his neck and lets him go. Here goes Chariots again, and look at the pace. Overcomes it, he has it. Can he stop him again? Yes, he does. The second time tonight that E.T. has saved a certain Great Britain try. Schofield was there. Now it's Daly. Once again, he's forced back inside. He loses it in the tackle, but Australia get the penalty. Getting adjacent to the posts. This is valuable. It is absolutely valuable. It has been Great Britain who have had possession 23 tackles to Australia's 14 down the other end. Jackson now short ball and a good one. Great hands, Meninga. Beautiful play from Wishart. Meninga again, still travelling. Meninga gets it in. Gillespie, he won't have the pace, but he gets it. Jackson, Meninga started it. Meninga will finish it. What a stunner. We have waited a long time. Inside the last five. Jackson, Jackson. Great ball. Lindner, Meninga, inside and out. Meninga had two men outside. Last tackle. Bradley Clyde, no. This should have been a try. Bradley Clyde shows his disappointment. Great opportunity. Yes, Mel, there were two men over. Simply just had to draw the fullback and offload to Clyde or Wishart or perhaps even Eddinghausen on the inside. Four points gone begging. The battle for the Ashes. It is taking its toll already on these two teams as they tie at a half time. Clark came from a mile back. Andy Platt, Gregory. They will go for goal. The advantage played, but only for a very short time. Brooks. They're on the board. Harrigan claims that he's been hit high, though. 
He's already caught one in the first half. Jackson, big back line. Clever stuff. Great hands from Daly. Meninga, keeping it alive back on the inside. Clyde! Australia do it again. Oh, Meninga's having a night. The captain grabs a double as he makes another test appearance for his country. Optus replay. The defence looked as though they had them covered. Walters looking the open side. Here come the Australians charging again. This is Bobby Lindner. Slips the ball back to Walters. Walters to Jackson. There's numbers here. Jackson gets to within two metres and still they can't score. How much pressure can they stand? Walters trying to dive over, but he's held up as well. They must come left. They have numbers left. Siren standing going to go himself. And that is the match winner. That's the clincher here as Surinam dives over under the post. It's 16 points to two. And there's 16 minutes left. It had to come. Great Britain were under pressure from every angle. Lighten a dummy half. Schofield very wide. So is Gregory. Not a good ball. He does well to pick up. Great hands. Great hands from Platt. Quickly to his feet. They are desperate. Lydon! Lydon with a smart kick! Sensational skill! Oh, yeah! With still some time, they get a look in. Just a small one. Great support play from him. They're skinny out wide. They're in big trouble. Quick hands. Clyde. Clyde still. Hancock will get it. Australia are red hot tonight. The hands out wide have been brilliant. Forget about the headache. Hancock's got himself a test try. Schofield's tried hard. Ball gets thrown a mile back for Jackson to pick up. It is gone. They might have done it at Wembley in 1990 to upset the apple cart. Not even a hit in the second half here. A great performance. Bob Fulton will be just more than pleased. They are on their way in the defence of the Ashes. 22 points to six to Australia over Great Britain.